Okay guys, we're making brownies today. I don't... Hey guys, it's Jenna. Welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you're new here. Today we're making fudge brownies by Betty Crocker because I don't have time to make homemade brownies. I don't know how to either. But honestly, I don't really like brownies, so I'm making these more for my family and maybe for my lunch crew tomorrow when I go back to school. But please ignore all the ruckus, the racket in the background. That's my annoying dog being annoying. So we're just gonna go ahead and get started and make the brownies. So let's go. First step is preheat the oven. And we have to preheat it to 350 degrees. I'm just gonna cut them open. <laughs> uh, I don't know if you guys can see Sunny, but she's up here helping us, so. Sunny, say hello. Anyways, back to what we were doing. Cut them open and just pour it in your large bowl. Two eggs and half a cup of vegetable oil. We're just gonna do the eggs first. Oh my God, that was really bad. I wish you guys could see that better, but it's okay. I'll crack them better this time. The next egg. And then we're just gonna take some Walmart brand vegetable oil and hopefully there's enough for half a cup. But fill it up to there and see what happens. Nope, incorrect. That's close enough, you know. And then it says three tablespoons, oh my God, I'm making a mess. Three tablespoons of water. I'm just gonna get a giant spoon and fill it up with water and then put it in here. So that's good. Just gonna like lightly run it. Sure, that's one. Two. And three. Pour it in there. barking son I have no idea why they're barking so could you not yummy these look really thick okay so I think they're done barking we're just gonna keep stirring until this is like really, really thick, but I think it's like pretty much done. <sighs> Looks pretty dank to me, but I'm not gonna taste it because I don't like brownies, so. Next step is you're gonna get a pan. This one is just square. And you're gonna cover it in tin foil. Ew. You know what, it really doesn't matter. You can be kind of ratchet. That's so on brand for me. And then, that looks good enough. You're gonna take some off-brand Pam and just spray. And make sure you spray the sides, that's too much, it's okay. Okay, next step, this is the best part. Let me zoom you guys in. Oh, we're out. This is gonna be the the good shot. Pour it in. Ooh, I see powder. That means I didn't mix it too good. Are we surprised? Not really. <laughs> and if you didn't mix it as good as you thought you did, like I didn't, mix it a little bit in here. And after you've done this, you can just uh, pop it in the oven when your oven's preheated and wait for it to bake, you know? She's ready to go in the oven. Yeah. 
You have been so rude this whole time that I'm trying to film. So very rude. Time to get them out of the oven. So Sunny loves to do this thing where she just like lays in front of the oven when it's time to take the stuff out. It's really great. Awesome, she got distracted. I really hope I don't burn myself. Wow. Stunning, sister. Sunny, how do you think they look? I think they look pretty good. So I'm just gonna quickly transfer them over to this paper plate and then stick them in the fridge. I'm literally just gonna lift it up, whoa, put it on the plate, and then stick it in the fridge. So I'm quickly just gonna do these dishes and then put them away and then when I'm done doing all that I'll get the brownies out and cut them and then give them to my family. Maybe the most ugly brownies I've ever seen, but I think it's fine. As long as they taste good, it's okay. Do they look pretty to you? Do you think the brownies are pretty? They're not for you. <laughs> no. Ew, I almost just threw up. That was disgusting.